What's up y'all bringing guys another video so as we all know on the 23rd of April April 23 2022 Tyson the Gypsy King Fury will be defending his WBC heavyweight title against his mandatory challenger Dillian White they'll be fighting over at the Wembley Stadium in the UK to be shown live on BT Sport box office pay-per-view for the UK fight fans and here in the United States of America it will be shown live on ESPN pay-per-view so um so yeah, uh, for the longest time, Dillian White has remained quiet leading up to this fight. Uh, he hasn't really mentioned about this fight. That hasn't really posting it or you know posting on social media. Hasn't really done any interviews leading up to this fight. But he actually finally did. If you follow him on social media, uh, he posted this little clip of uh, Val Nutrition, uh, that little promo with Val Nutrition, and uh, he said, and I quote, he said, "I'm ready." I'm looking forward to seeing everyone on the 23rd of April at Wembley Stadium. Hashtag Let's Go at Frank Warren at BT Sport at Wembley Stadium at Val Nutrition. And uh, yeah, finally, <laughs> finally, 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 Dylan White is talking. Uh, didn't really say much. I mean, if you watch a clip, it just shows him working out. He looks ready, though. I mean, it looks like it's in great shape based on the, the clip. Um, and I can't wait to see what he can bring to the table to beat uh, Tyson Fury. I mean, it's it's definitely a fight where uh, he can win. Um, just simply because it's the heavyweight division. One punch can change the entire fight. And uh, one of those people that think he will definitely win against Tyson Fury is this man right here. Mr. David Hay. Um <laughs> Yeah, he was recently interviewed by Talk Sport uh, here on YouTube. Go shout out to Talk Sport Boxing. Go subscribe to them. Uh, they do like a podcast thing also. Um, but yeah, he if you watch the interview, he said somewhere around the lines that um, you know he thinks he's going with White. He thinks White's gonna pull off the upset because White, Dillian White, is uh, an opponent that has all the attributes. Is a type of opponent that has all the attributes, all the things that is necessary to beat somebody like Tyson Fury. Um, I'm guessing it's power, speed, um, and that's the big thing. Uh, but can he actually do it against uh, Tyson Fury? Uh, if you're betting against Tyson Fury in this fight and you're putting thousands and millions of dollars... Um, on Dillian White to win, uh, or if you plan to actually, don't, don't bet on Dillian White to win because the moment David Hay picks an opponent, especially when it comes to Tyson Fury, um, Tyson Fury all, always ends up winning, and David Hay has been going against Tyson for the longest time. <laughs> so, so yeah, it's uh. Right now, it's probably best not to go with what David Hay is going because he's in a he's in a streak right now of picking against Tyson Fury, um, and Tyson Fury always proves David Hay wrong. I don't know why David Hay keeps picking like he he puts you know he gives his reasons, but um, you know he's always wrong when it comes to Tyson Fury. It's always wrong. So yeah. I just thought I'd share that with you guys. So if you're planning, again, if you're planning on betting on Dylan White to win, don't. Because David Hay has definitely guaranteed him picking, Dave, David Hay picking Dylan White to win has definitely guaranteed the win for Tyson Fury. At least that's the way I look at it. Anyway, I'm looking forward to the fight. Can't wait. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.